realize guys um somebody just realized if you're if you think your device get is getting bricked it's not now i'm going to i'm going to show this to you just for the sake okay now i'm going to turn off my device and in this sense it's going to lose the jailbreak since it is tethered um so you know when you lose a jet when you lose a tethered jailbreak you have to go almost drop the camera um you have to go back here you have to put the firmware back on you have to click just boot so i'm going to go back and show you that you have to select the firmware and you have to go just just boot so click that and that's it but see look ipod's back on you see the apple logos there because it is a tethered jailbreak keeps have to saying that. Now, with that, your iPod will sit here for days if you just leave it like this. Now, what you're going to have to do is you think it's going to you think it's going to be bricked. It's not. Don't worry. It's not bricked. Okay. It's not bricked. You just have to do the um, jailbreak steps all over again. 2 3 1 2 3 Oh yeah. Oh. Clicking the holding and clicking the power button will not turn the device off when it's plugged in. You have to hold both of them. Wait a few seconds holding it, and then and then take your finger off the power button. Keep holding the home button. And then your iPod will be once again exploited. By Lime Rain, or my Lime Rain Red Snow. And waiting for reboot. Back over to the iPod. And it has the pineapple logo. That is um, how to unbrick your device. Even though it's not really bricked, people just freak out when that happens and don't know what to do. And then they just quit on jailbreaking. Like I almost did a few minutes ago. Okay, so that's it. Um, make sure you follow these steps, and uh, happy hunting. I don't know why I said that. <laughs>